Meet Rizzler. He's a Samoyed cross. And he should have a long white coat, but he's been given a summer trim. Look, I know he looks like an overgrown puppy, but he's actually 12, which is 84 in dog years. And there's one more important fact about Rizzler. He's deaf. Rizzler. Hello, Rizzler. Aren't you lovely? Is this common in dogs, in white dogs? Because it, you get white Dalmatians, yeah. don't you, a deaf? It doesn't seem to have been sort of fully proven, but it seems a lot more common in white dogs. Helen's one of Battersea's behavioural experts, and today we're going to teach this old dog some new commands. How do you communicate with him? We actually use sign language. I can do that. So it's not... And um, he, I don't think he knows that one. That's what? drunk on whiskey. <laughs> I think if he lived with me, he'd get to know it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think we better start with the basics. First, we decide on a sign for good dog. Good boy. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. So, I mean, for sit, it's the, sim it's the same thing we do for other dogs. It's yeah. that kind of that, sit down. Because yeah. the nose goes up, the yeah. bum goes down. Yeah. Do you want to see if you can get him to do his sits? Sit. Sit. <laughs> No, I'm having any luck, Try am more I? more like putting it right in and then and then lifting it up. I can't get things. dogs with hearing to sit, let alone. Me. <laughs> sit, no, lie down. Sit. Ah, he's a good boy. So very soon he'll learn when he gets his treat that that means good boy. Good boy. Yeah. To teach the um, down, if you can get him in the sit first and then show him the treat, and then we take the treat sort of down like that. He's like, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know I am. I know, I'm, I know I'm a good boy. You don't have to clap there. <laughs> Somebody throw you the fish in the end. <laughs> I think Rizzler's done very well for his first lesson. He definitely deserves a little run around. There's just one problem. How do we call him back? Oh, why am I doing that? See, this would be me in the park. <laughs> As lovely as Rizzler is, he's not going to be easy to rehome. But somewhere out there, there's a family waiting for him. We've just got to find them. I've spent the last few weeks watching people fall in love with all sorts of different dogs. <laughs> Come on, say, say goodbye. Old dogs. <laughs> fat dogs. You're unbelievable. Shy dogs. And so I just know someone's going to fall in love with an old deaf dog who looks like Rupert the Bear. But all the same, I think he needs some positive advertising. So it's time to call in a favour. Yep, Rizzler's going on the telly. I mean, I know he's on telly now, but this is the first time he went on telly and, and we filmed him going on telly and now we're going to put it on the... T oh, you know what I mean. <laughs> How old is he? He's 12 years old. Is he? Yeah, he doesn't look like that. You're like a baby. <laughs> Aww. Well, look at you, Rizzler, making time with the celebs. He's going on a new slot on this morning to help rescue pets find new homes. Hey, guess what, guys? Rizzler's on the telly. Come and say, come and say, here's Rizzler. Come and have a look. Look, here's Rizzler on the telly. Are we ready, folks? Let's move on uh, to Rizzler. Oh, Rizzler. And Rizzler is totally deaf. Do you think Rizzler's going to get a home out of this? What do you reckon? I think he will. I hope so. Love Thank him. you. Can you Thank help you. with Rizzler? Fingers crossed, eh, anyway. Now, if you don't mind, I would like to watch Doctors. Thank you very much. Just your favourite programme, isn't it? 